Hello friends, Assalamu alaikum. Welcome back to my channel. I hope you're all doing well. And this is the makeup look that I came up with. This is the Karina Kapoor inspired makeup look that you all have seen. Obviously, the pictures are all around the social media. And as soon as I looked at the photos, I was like, I need to recreate this. So I just got these flowers and filmed this look for you guys. So if you guys want to see how I do it, please keep on watching. But first, please like, comment and subscribe to my channel and share this video with your friends if you like it. So without further ado, let's start the video. First thing we're going to do is apply some foundation. I'm mixing the LA Pro Matte Foundation with the NYX Foundation. I have face my face moisturized and primed. So I'm going directly with the foundation. I'm going to take a smaller brush and cover the areas which the bigger brush cannot. And I'm going to go with the beauty blender over the top to give my skin a beautiful finish. After that, I'm going to use a lip pro concealer to hide my dark circles and I'm going to blend this out with the beauty blender as well. After that, to give my face a little more highlight, I'm going to apply some Makeup Revolution concealer which is in the shade C2 or I will under eyes ko highlight my under eyes it makes my face look more highlighted and nice if I only want to cover my dark circles I skip this step and use only one concealer but today I wanted more brightness so I'm using two and I'm going to blend this concealer out with a beauty blender as well I don't know if you guys noticed or not I have filled in my eyebrow today because so many of you message me and they want to see how my eyebrow looks filled in I don't like the look of it but I did it for the sake of you people let me know if you like it filled in or not now I'm taking the translucent powder by Glam Girl Mavish and I'm going to bake my under eyes with that. I'm going to keep the powder for like 2 minutes and then wipe it off with a bigger brush. Now I'm taking this Huda Beauty Rose Gold Palette and taking the brown shade and applying it all over my crease. This is the only shade that I'm using for my eyes today. Puri eyes will blend karna uske baad lower lash line pe bhi mas ko blend karungi to make my eyes look more nice and smoky. I'm applying the same color all over my lid as well. Uske baad I'm taking this aqua liner by Krylon or I have not brush wet with the dry brush I am going to apply this and blend this out with a smaller brush eyeliner ki tarah apply karna hai, blend out karna hai. intensity jitni aapko rakhni hai, utna you have to apply the black shade and I want it to be it to be a little more black so I applied it a little more if you guys want to keep it more soft so you guys can apply less and this is a very good way to create a smoky eye as well you can apply this all over your lids and blend it out with a brown shadow now i'm taking this mascara which is not good at all and coating my lashes with that i'm going to apply some black shadow and blend it out with a brown shadow on my lower lash line to give my eyes a bit more smokiness on the lower lash line uske baad main apne inner corners ko highlight kar rahi hu from the same palette now quickly off camera i'm going to apply my lashes these are naomi by sweet touch and now i'm bronzing my face with summer of love bronzer as always i absolutely love this bronzer this is by makeup revolution i'm going to bronze my forehead my jawline and i'm going to contour my nose with this as well उसके बाद मैं यूज कर रही हूं ब्लश यह है कलर एक्सप्रेस कंपनी से व्हिच इज अ वेरी ब्यूटीफुल पीची कलर एंड आई लव दिस वेरी पिगमेंटेड यू हैव टू बी वेरी केयरफुल व्हाइल अप्लाइंग इट आई एम गोइंग इन विद अ ब्यूटी ब्लेंडर टू ब्लेंड एवरीथिंग टुगेदर 
and then i'm going to highlight my face with a soft palette by makeup revolution i'm taking these two golden shades subtle highlight chahiye tha zyada tez highlight nahi chahiye tha isliye i used the lighter shades which are very pretty as well now i'm taking a lipstick which is by color express as well it's in the shade romeo and applying it all over my lips and i have a hack if you want to make your lipstick shade lighter just mix it with some concealer and you will get the perfect shade that you want like i did and now we are moving on to the hair firstly i'm going to part my hair from the center and i'm going to back comb the sides to give my hair a little more volume right se bhi thoda sa back comb karungi left se bhi aur thoda sa back se bhi you will see it within like 2 minutes what i do and if i'm going somewhere i will use a setting spray while back combing but i was just at home and doing this tutorial so i did not use any hair spray but if you are planning to do this on any event please use a hair spray Now I'm going to braid my hair from the sides and I'm going to make a dutch braid. I'm just going to pick some hair from the front section and some hair from the back section and just going to braid my hair. If you guys don't know how to do it, please let me know. I can do a complete video on that. And I'm just braiding my hair and I'm keeping it nice and tight. I'm taking some bobby pins and pinning it to the back of my head and as you can see i just pulled out some strands of my hair to give it a softer look i'm just going to pull the braid a little bit and make it a um, little more voluminous and just setting it the way i want it to be I'm doing the same thing on the other side as well and yes I'm holding my hair in my mouth they are clean they are mine if you have any issue with that please don't watch me and I'm just going to bobby pin this side as well Now I'm going to tie my hair from the back I'm going to make a jura and just rolling my hair around and I'm going to take a hair tie and tie my hair with that and just fixing it a little bit just pulling some hair out giving it a messy rough look and now i'm going to take some jura pins like these and i'm just going to stick them under my head sorry under my hair and just fix my jura and make it more secure here comes my favorite and very exciting part i'm going to put this in my hair i got these flowers from a real flower shop they are real i couldn't find the fake ones i was trying to find the fake ones so i can use them later as well but i couldn't find them so i had to get the real ones i'm just going to cut them and take the amount of flower i want in my hair and just tuck them in they stayed like pretty good and they were not falling off or anything i'm just fixing them the way i want they look so beautiful they just made the whole look come to life and this is such a nice and easy hairstyle i will definitely do this in the future weddings and stuff i really liked it i'm going to do the same thing on the other side putting some flower and yeah that's it I'm just cutting some flowers and fixing them according to my hair and now I'm going to straighten sorry curl my hair with a straightener and just curl these strands and it will give it a more softer beautiful romantic look which we all want If you guys want to see a tutorial on how I curl my hair with a straightener please let me know in the comments below and that's pretty much it you guys this is the completed look i'm so happy with how it turned out to be 
and if you guys liked it please let me know if you want me to improve something please give me the feedback i would love to listen to that and i really hope you guys loved it and if you did please like comment and subscribe and i will see you guys very soon in my next video bye